Nearly a week later now, the Riverside County Registrar of Voters is still counting ballots and a few local races remain too close to call. In the city of Coachella, current Mayor Stephen Hernandez holds a lead of just about 80 votes over sitting Coachella Council Member Denise Delgado. In the race for the 47th State Assembly District, Democrat Christy Holstead continuing to hold a lead over Republican Greg Wallace. And a race that could help determine the balance of power in D.C., the race for the 41st Congressional District, remains too close to call. Incumbent Ken Calvert holding a lead of just about 4,000 votes over Democratic challenger Will Rollins. We are expecting another update from the Registrar in about an hour around 6 o'clock. Going into today, the county still had over 100,000 ballots to count. News Channel 3's Tatum Larson live tonight at the Registrar's office in Riverside with more on this process and why it takes so, so long. That, that's right, John. Vote by mail and provisional ballots are still being counted here at the registrar's office. Now, I went into this office right here where the votes are still being counted, and I'm not alone. Voters have become volunteers here as ballot observers, and they're here to observe the ballot counting process as it continues. Okay, thank you. That's why I'm here, really, is because of freedom and their checks and balances, and, and that's a good thing. Ron Edwards is volunteering for the first time as a ballot observer here at the Riverside County Registrar's Office. He, like many volunteers, believe in due process and above all transparency as ballots are still being counted. And it has to be to have the checks and the balances. Things can't be too fast. Uh, I believe there's opportunity for improvement. Though. This is a look inside the ballot counting room nearly a week after Election Day. The Riverside County Registrar's Office says that 111 vote by mail ballots and 10,000 provisional ballots still need to be processed. This also includes ballots that were postmarked on or before the general election day. This puts an even tighter squeeze on some candidates who are tied up in a neck and neck race, like Congressman Ken Calvert and Will Rollins. Latest numbers have them separated by just about 4,000 votes. Both asked for help from volunteers to watch ballot counting. Yeah, it doesn't matter if it's football, baseball, basketball, it could be swimming, hockey, whatever. Uh, you want the referee to be impartial. Uh, you don't want him to have a player in the game. And you want things to be fair. You want the referee to be fair. While the registrar sorts through uncounted ballots like these, candidates and voters will continue to wait for the final results. Now, there are limits to what and where observers can observe here at the registrar's office. Now, if you want to watch the ballots be counted live, you can head to KESQ.com. Live in Riverside, Tatum Larson, News Channel 3.